This question is taken from circle. You can see here we have an unseen theorem. In a given figure, A, B, C, D is a cyclic quadrilateral. You can see here A, B, C, D is a cyclic quadrilateral. All the four points touch this circumference, so cyclic quadrilateral. The side C, D, C, D is produced up to E. And if A, D is bisect, this A, D bisect B, D, E. It means A, D bisect B, D, E means this angle and this angle both are equal. Bisect means this A, D bisect. Uh, B D E means this line divides this whole angle B D E into two equal parts this part and this part will be equal if here 40 degree then here also 40 degree prove that A B C is an isolated triangle we have to prove that A B C is an isolated triangle to prove that isolated triangle we have to prove two sides are equal or base angles are equal anything we have to show but here side doesn't matter we have to prove because side is not given we angles are given so we have to prove here two angles are equal so let's take a start first of all we have to write down here given what is given in the question we have to write here a b c d is a cyclic quadrilateral the side CD produce to E and AD is the bisector of angle BDE and what we have to prove to prove you can see here ABC ABC is an isolated triangle we have to write down so triangle ABC is an isolate triangle we have to prove so we wrote here after this we have to write on here statements and here we have to write on a reason we have to write on a statement as well as a reason now look at here in first number what we can write which is already given here a d b and a d e both are equal so we can write here angle a d e is equal to angle a d b both are equal what is the reason from here AD being bis bisector of angle BDE so AD bisect angle BDE in number two we can write here look at properly angle ADE is equal to angle ABC look at this diagram ADE A D E this angle is equal to A B C this angle this angle and this angle are equal exterior angle is equal to opposite interior angle of cyclic quadrilateral we have to write on so here we have to write on the exterior angle of cyclic quadrilateral is equal to the opposite opposite interior angle if you not understand is writing but i am explaining so hope you can uh, write on it properly after that in number three we have to write down you you can see here a d e a d lhs equals so rhs also equals so we can write here a d b is equal to angle a b c from where we have to write on from statement one and two we can write on so write let's write on here from statement 1 and 2 you can see here lhs equal ade ade so rhs also equal now you can see here a look at the diagram a d b a d b this angle and a b c a b c this angle both angles are equal but we have to show isolate triangle okay in number four now look at here number four angle a d B is equal to angle A C B. Look at properly. A D B. This angle and this one. A C B. This angle. This angle and this angle. Both angles are equal. What is the reason? Inscribe angle is standing on a same arc or angle at circumference. You can write anything. In number four, we can write angle at circumference is standing on a same arc 
on same arc a b this both angles are standing on a same arc a b this angle and this angle now in number 5 you can see here again a d b and a d b both are equal it means this two also equal so we can write angle a b c is equal to angle a c b from where from statement 3 and 4 now look at here diagram a b c a b c this angle and a c b a c b this angle these two angles are equal and what we have to show ABC is a isolated triangle. If base angles are equal, these two angles are equal means base angle equal. Base angle are equal means ABC is an isolated triangle. So in number six we can write triangle ABC is an isolated triangle. In number six we have to write from statement five being base angles equal if base angles are equal then that triangle is isolated triangle hope you understand this unseen theorem taken from class 10 